so we thought we'd come back over here to RV1 and give it another look. Come on, we're going to show you the Paradigm. Alright, so here we go. This is the Paradigm Alliance RV that we liked. The thought of the Super Show. So, Outdoor storage. I can't open it. It's locked. It's locked, but it's big. Come on in. Take a look. Come on in. Pretty entertainment center with that nice fireplace. It's not plugged in so we can't show you any of these cool features. Lots of storage. I'm sure this makes into a bed. And you're ready for this. Ooh. More storage. Storage in your fireplace. Got USB charging stations. Pet friendly. <laughs> Huge island. And a nice color. Very nice color. One thing I like about the cabinets on top of the soft close is uh, is the contrast in color. So it kind of kind of separates the living room and the kitchen. Very nice. Full residential fridge. Thank you, Vanna. It's got a connector to the... Ah. And this whole other separate area over here. Look at this kitchen. Beautiful stove. Four burners. I don't know if I'd use the oven. I think it would make the place too hot, wouldn't it? But anyway, it's pretty awesome. Four burners. Are you ready? So this would be your living and dining area. Plenty of windows, room for you to cook. another storage area uh, but it has a light up here but not a light throughout so I would think you'd have to set some lights up in here but pretty nice the whole barn door thing everywhere's got the little barn doors little seating areas on each side of the dresser that's nice I guess you would consider this a walk-in closet and it does have an opportunity to put a washer dryer in here a washer on this side and a dryer on this side which i think we'd want a washer and dryer i think so yeah this closet is pretty huge i mean i guess you lose some of it if you put a washer there but And the barn door. Slide that. And the barn door. Pretty nice. That's why we like the paradigm. It's got some modern updated features. And colors. Very good colors. Alright, I'm gonna show you how much room you have in the shower. I mean Seriously. Oh. 
There's a lot of room. I need a shower. I'm sweating in Florida. Anyway, this is huge. There's room for two. Okay, here's the five S's. Style, size, space, storage, and setup. Number one, style. Style. So what we like about Paradigm is the style is um, up to date. Feels like with all the features of the soft glide, drawers, um, the shower stall, the colors of the, the wood, the two different colors. It just, it seems like they've brought the style into 2020. So we really like the style of it. Size. So if I was thinking size, the length, uh, the length's 37, 38 feet. So it's not the shortest, but it's certainly the longest, and it gives you a lot for the size. So as far as getting into parks, pulling from a vehicle, those kind of things, I think the link is about perfect. Yeah. Space inside. Plenty of space. I mean, you saw the storage everywhere. There's storage. Um, there's no. I, I didn't feel packed if I'm in the kitchen. He's in the living room. The shower, tons of space. Bedroom, tons of space. Tons of drawers. That closet, you saw how big that closet was. Plenty of room. Storage. I, I think there's a lot of storage for this one for the size, so I don't think we have any problems fitting what we have currently that would go in there. Yeah, plenty of room. And lastly, setup, which affects both of us. Setup. It's going to take a little bit more. We think, um, from what we hear, there's a little more to do when you have a fifth wheel versus pulling it in a Class A. So. Just uh, something we'd have to figure we're gonna, out. We're going to be like, we're going to have a checklist like everybody else. And so I don't think setup would be all too awful bad. But it is more setup work than it is for a Class A. Yeah. And we'd have to get a new truck, which would be awesome. Yeah. But overall, we'd rate this uh, RV pretty pretty high. Yeah. Four out of five. Because we don't know what our five. five is. But this yeah. could be five because we would probably buy one of these. Yeah, if for I sure. was going for a fifth wheel, I would I would definitely consider this as one of my top contenders. Yep. Anyway, there you have it. There you have it. So until next time. Seatbelts on. Seatbelts on.